Hi mom, Sarah, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alyssa and this is everything I got for Christmas this year. Okay, some of these are from myself. But that's besides the point. First things first, I got this crew neck or sweatshirt from Aritzia. This is what it looks like. I'm obsessed with the color. I was fully influenced by CJ. She showed this jacket to me. It was on sale and I, I just had to have it. The next one is an Aritzia zip-up jacket. Ate Marian gave it to me. She's my boyfriend's sister. We were at Aritzia and at first I thought she was joking when she asked me what I wanted for Christmas because she already got me this bath bomb which has a necklace inside that's worth either $15 or $5,000 and she got me a freaking zip up hoodie that I was gonna get myself anyway it was really nice I love it it won't be Christmas if you didn't receive any socks which you can tell that I already used it I bought this one for myself it is a TNA base angle sock it is pretty big for me it is a size medium to large I'm a small to medium but it fits well so it's fine I'm not complaining and they look super pretty and super like minimalistic anyway so my NARS bronzer broke like it shattered I didn't have a bronzer so I got myself this Tarte palette it has a bronzer a blush and a highlight when I bought those stuff at Sephora they gave me my birthday gift which is from the hair brand Amica this dry shampoo I already know that this is gonna be in my holy grail for next year because I just gave up completely on dry shampoo I always thought that I just had too much hair it was too oily for any dry shampoo out there but when I tried these Game changer. I'm going to buy five more. They also gave me two hair masks. I'm so excited to use these just because I love the dry shampoo so much. So I have high hopes for these ones. Also, I'm getting my hair done mid-January, I think. And I'm so excited for it. So stay tuned for that. Speaking of Atestef and hair care, she got me this Chi T3 shampoo and conditioner. She asked me what I wanted for Christmas and I just told her that... I wanted a shampoo and conditioner that would suit my hair well because I have pretty oily hair and it was weird because I would wash it today and then the next day it would be so oily and I would have to wash it again and it would end up killing my ends because they would be so dry so I asked her to just buy me some shampoo and conditioner that she thinks would work great in my hair this has a pump to it we dropped it yesterday so it broke but it's okay she also got me this verb ghost oil they're converting me to become a hair girly I'm so excited to go on this journey because I didn't care about my hair for the longest time and I'm just now getting it done so thank you at the step for the hair care product and besides the hair care she also got me this mug it says I'd rather be watching friends it's three of my favorite things it's friends pink and coffee so love it this was a gift set it came with two hand cream yeah with two hand cream there's a pink one and then there's a blue one I gave my mom the pink one just because I have enough hand cream in my purses and last thing at the step got me I know she got me a lot of stuff she got me a yarn and this crocheting hook. I don't know what it's called, but for the longest time I wanted to I wanted to start crocheting, but I don't know why I never started. So she just gave me the push to start. I was doing this all night last night. I'm so excited to learn. I was teasing her that her next Christmas person is gonna be like a scarf or something. And she tried to take it back, but too bad. <laughs> Anyways, thank you Atista for all the presents. I appreciate it so much. Okay, so I had a Christmas party, I want to say two weeks ago. And we did a white elephant and I got this hair straightener from Revlon. This is a very new design. Like I've never seen a hair straightener that looks like this. Like it literally has a hole. Doesn't it look like a cramper? It does, right? Like, I'm not crazy. I don't have a hair straightener. Again, I don't really touch my hair that much. Thankfully, nobody stole it from me because, again, it was a white elephant gift. Okay, so next up, this book set that I got from Indigo. I got this for myself. So this is a light that you clip onto a book, and then it lights it so you can read in the dark. Isn't that so cool? And it has, like, three settings, I think. One, one, two... Oh, it has two setting and then this is just a book holder you put your book in here and then you put it in your bag just so it doesn't get wrinkled with all your stuff inside your bag and this is a bookmark it says this is where I fell asleep and I just thought it was so cool it was so cute and it was on sale for like 20 bucks for all three of them which is such a steal and then next up is the self-care kit from Bath and Body Works this is from my boyfriend's brother and his girlfriend it was really cute this 
smells like high school. I haven't smelled this since high school. It came with a hand cream and a shower gel as well as a body lotion. Thank you so much, Gwen Adi, for my present. I don't know if you guys watch my videos, but if you do, thank you. Next up is this big thing. So me and my boyfriend went to his work party and they did white elephant there as well. And this is what we got. So I got this throw blanket, which is gonna go perfectly in this couch. And it's so soft, it's so cozy, and so nice. I was settling for the headphones, but last minute they stole it, they stole my present and exchanged it with this one. And you know what? That was the best thing that ever happened to me because this is so soft. And my boyfriend got a bunch of towels, which I told him are gonna stay in the apartment because I need more towels. You can never have too many towels, especially in this apartment where my boyfriend's always over, my parents are always over, my friends are always over, so I you can I can never have enough towels, okay? These are good presents. And then for my boyfriend's presents, he got me a hard drive. This is actually for my birthday, but I didn't open it until Christmas, so yeah, he got me a portable hard drive which has four terabytes in it. I told him that I needed a new one because mine is full. That's why I can't like edit any of my vlogs because I'm just I just don't have enough storage to do so. And he just got me a four terabyte one. That was really cool of him, so thank you, honey. And he also got me this Dior gift set. I am genuinely gonna display this in my closet because that is gorgeous. So yeah, this is the Jador scent and it is amazing. I love the scent of it. This scent is so floral and flowery that it's so far from the, the cologne that I've been using for the past two years, which is the Jo Malone um, English Oak one. I feel like if I'm gonna be channeling my feminine energy this 2023 i think i need to smell like flowers and roses and feminine energy all around so this is perfect for that the set also came with a body lotion that also smells like flowers i was going to buy the miss dior once before like i don't know like six months ago but then i found this jador perfume so i think it is pretty new i'm i don't know but when i smelled this i was like okay i don't want the miss dior anymore i want the jador one so he got me it and it's so nice and i love it so much i also got a present from my boyfriend's cousin she got me an adidas shorts as well as an adidas leggings but i i keep forgetting it at her place like i don't know why i had two chances to take it i forgot it but she's gonna be coming over here tomorrow because we're gonna go clubbing she just turned 18 so she we're gonna go clubbing and maybe i'll post it on my instagram story so go follow me there i know you already saw my glasses this is what my parents got for me their prescription glasses we all know how expensive prescription glasses can get so i'm so grateful that they paid for it they even paid for my eye exam this was a great gift thank you so much mom and dad for the glasses i appreciate you guys so much cj got me a google chromecast so so my TV doesn't have a remote on it. I just use my phone to cast whatever I want to watch. And she got me a Chromecast that has a remote on it. And it looks like this. And this is the remote. But yeah, she got me this. And I'm really thankful for it because again, remote. And she mentioned that there's two more presents on the way. So I'm so excited to show you guys that. I'm so excited to see it. Like, I don't know what it is. But anyway, thank you so much, CJ. You made my life so much easier with this one. And thank you for everybody who, who gave me a gift. I love you all so much. I appreciate y'all. But now, onto the gifts that I bought for myself because I got myself a lot. When I tell you it is self-love central, it is self-love central up in this apartment. I got myself an anthropology shirt that it's just like, a shirt that like wraps around your body like that. It's really pretty. I might wear it to the club tomorrow. Then Victoria's Secret had a huge sale. They were 40% off store wide. I got myself this sports bra that I can use as a tank top. It has support underneath, so it's really great. But at the same time, they have like fleece on the outside, so it like hugs your body really nice. I got them in two colors. I already wore the peach one. I got myself a Steve Madden sheet set. It's baby pink. It was just a nice and practical present for myself. Follow me on TikTok. You already saw that I got myself some boots. They're platform because again, I am 5'11". Not 5'11", hello? And they're platform because I am 5'2". I actually think I'm 5 feet. But anyway, that's not the point. And then... This is for Boxing Day. If you guys don't know, Boxing Day is like a massive sale after the day after Christmas here in Canada. 
and I got myself some stuff at Forever 21 because they were having such a massive sale. For this massive bag, I paid $36. And this is the only thing that I bought for myself this Boxing Day. I got myself this brown faux leather jacket i don't know if you guys see it but it's massive it used to be 90 dollars, and i got it for 20. that is such a good deal like i told myself that i wasn't gonna buy anything this boxing day just because i bought myself so much for christmas but how can you like not buy it it used to be 90 and it's 20. and the material is very good too so go off forever 21. i got this bodysuit the one that looks like a wrestler uniform Everybody and their mothers has this on TikTok. So I was like, you know what? It's $10. Yes, I got this for $10. So why not just buy it for yourself? See how it looks. And the material is also like ribbed. So I guess it's flattering. I'm really not sure. I don't know what I'm talking about. And the last thing I got is the infamous TikTok leggings. I know I'm late to the game. I genuinely just wanted to try this out. It was five bucks. So I was like, fuck it. Five for five bucks. Yeah, I would try it. And look at the butt. If this doesn't make my butt look snatched, I'm gonna sue. I'm not even kidding. It is $36. Do you see it? That's such a fucking steal. I was gonna buy more, but I held myself back just because, again, I bought myself so much stuff for Christmas. And I also bought a bunch of people's stuff for Christmas, so I was like, okay, maybe I should like pump the brakes and calm down a little. Because I was in a bit of a shopping spree the past couple of weeks, so I was like, mm -mm. hello, just pump pump the brakes a little that is everything that i got for christmas i'm gonna show you guys all the late presents i get in my instagram story so make sure you're following me on instagram or i'm gonna be showing it on tiktok so make sure you're following me there too everything is at yayalissa that is a wrap thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure to give it a big thumbs up comment down below what you got for christmas or what you got your loved ones for christmas and make sure you subscribe because you're already watching me so might as well subscribe and ring that notification bell so that you don't miss and upload but anyway i hope you guys had a lovely holidays and i hope you're having such a lovely day and i will see you guys on the next one bye